Well, hi. So I'm John Franklin. I'm practicing here in the beautiful um, Fledgen Islands, primarily on um, St. Thomas. I was um, born in Anguilla, a neighboring island, uh, did high school, and then all of my higher education was um, uh, performed in the United States and returned to the uh, Virgin Islands in 2000, where I established uh, the Virgin Islands Urologic Center. The Promaxo uh, MRI has um, allowed us to modify our approach. Uh, we are now doing uh, uh, biopsies via the transperineal approach. And so we are able to do more uh, targeted uh, biopsies. Uh, we're finding that this is uh, uh, quite uh, facile for us to um, adapt. So it has not been a huge uh, burden. A learning curve has been um, uh, quite um, rapid. And, and uh, we are, as a service and as a practice, uh, enjoying um, the, the, the procedures. And our, our patients are appearing to be uh, quite um, as satisfied um, with, the, with the approach. One of the values that we also see with this um, uh, technology is our opportunity to reintroduce uh, cryotherapy in, in our practice and to be able to uh, perform a more focal-based uh, therapy with this um, modality, as opposed to in the past, we've only done the, the whole gland uh, uh, cryotherapy. Our patients uh, thus far have been um, uh, very, very satisfied. They, they are aware of the um, value of converting the procedure from transrectal approach uh, to the, the, the transperineal approach. Uh, our patients uh, have been very satisfied with the, with the modality. It's, um, uh, cutting edge. It enhances our ability to do uh, more um, targeted based um, biopsies. It's easy to adapt. The learning curve has been um, quite a narrow for us. We've uh, been able to adapt very well uh, to this um, to this modality.